Stevenson opens Matt Commonwealth play with a 2-1 win over Eastern today. Glenn Clark with head coach Graham Miller. Coach, have you thought about maybe like having the scoreboard say you're down 1-0 when the game starts to try to get your guys to play like that? I think you're right. I think you're right. I mean, as we just talked about at halftime, I mean, I think, uh, yeah, why don't we put one up there? Maybe the maybe the mental image will get them going from the start. <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, it, it is. It does. It, I know we've talked about it before, but there is something to be said. The resilience of this group that every time their back's against the wall, I know you would have liked to have turned a few more of them into W's earlier in the year, but that they continue to respond to adversity and and show up and play really hard. I mean, you guys dominated the second half. Yeah, and that's that's exactly it. I mean, I, I don't worry if we go a goal down. I hate going a goal down, but this group is a special group. They've been able to fight back all season uh, when we've been down, especially you know in some games where we've been down by two goals. So the fact is, we uh, we stayed in it. Um, wasn't happy at all with the first half performance, and, and it was a tale of two halves, uh, Glenn. That second half was exactly the way we should be playing for 90 minutes. The urgency, the passion, the playing for the badge, and uh, two lovely goals from everything we've been working on the last few days. The the corners obviously producing those two goals, right? Let's start with the first one and Saul just, you know, getting in there, continuing to battle after the ball and stick your foot at and see, make something good happen. Well, we actually do that drill a lot. So we, we just did it um, uh, yesterday, actually, we do it. So we do a lot of stuff on corners and a lot of those ones where the ball does drop. And so we practice that to be ready for that little ping ball. And, and it couldn't have fallen to a probably a more smoother player that is more composed than Marv. And, uh, and obviously, even with the mask on, it was a nice finish. <laughs> and then how about Logan getting that moment, like sticking his, himself up in there, staying in. And, you know, especially as the ball started heading the other way for him to retreat, get back into position. There was so much good involved with that. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, that's a striker's finish right there. I mean, uh, Lo uh, Logan's a big uh, Man United fan, so we call him Harry Maguire, unfortunately, because uh, Harry's not playing well. So so that was a good a good way for Harry to uh, to put the ball in the back. And then he, he came in, you know, first half, and we didn't feel we were winning balls in the air. And he just, you know, Logan, as a senior, really just took over there in that game. And, and just a great great for him to get his first first goal. And, and what a finish. Like I said, striker's finish, really happy for him. You talked about this being the start of a new season. How good do you feel about getting the win, the open conference play, kind of erasing some of the tough um, results that you had early on in the year and putting your head forward now moving forward in the conference? Yeah, the only record we're worried about now is that conference record. So we're 1-0, and that's where we want it to be after today. You know, this conference is a real tough conference. It's going to be a battle every single game. Uh, and I always tell the guys, you got to win your four home games. If you can win your four home games, it gives you that opportunity to be in the playoffs. So the fact is, you know, that second half, you know, showed how important it was to win today. And I'm really, really happy that um, that we produced what we what we can do, uh, especially in a wet day like this and being off our grass. And it was uh, just a great second half to be able to get that first conference win. Coach, congratulations. Thanks, as always, for taking the time. Always appreciate it, Glenn. Graham Miller, I'm Glenn Clark, GoMustangSports.com.